welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video it's a really 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 small video today very very short indeed but uh, I thought I'd just put it out there it's um, something that uh, I mentioned uh, in my last video that uh, uh, this actual uh, mat uh, needed uh, washing uh, so what I did I, I did do what I said I was going to do I took it home I actually did uh, use the power wash on it um, unfortunately um, you can still see that there's lines in it and I think that's just obviously where the um, the color has come out and faded uh, with the Sun and that you know through the doorway so that's lovely and clean now but this here this is uh, got four Phillips screws in it which you can see there and what I want to do just basically is to lift that up um, just clear any debris that's sitting underneath it uh, and then screw it back down and then put the mat back in I want to show you how to do the mat it's just something that I thought maybe uh, people don't know uh, and they just sweep it and think well okay that's that, that's good enough but you can actually take these mats out and they're really really easy to uh, put back in so let's just undo that my trusty cordless drill Now I'm not getting, this isn't sponsored or anything, but I actually bought this cordless drill from Amazon. Now this actually was less than 20 quid. Um, and this is brilliant, absolutely brilliant. It's got the light on it, it's got all the attachments. It comes with several drill bits. Um, you know, they're not, they're not brilliant, but they do come with drill bits. Um, but this is fantastic, absolutely fantastic. It's nothing special. I can use it, I can abuse it, and it still comes back and wants more. So anyway, let's just, Put that all up there they're the four screws right so okay all right okay you can see that there's dirt underneath the dirt starts to fall out okay um i don't know if that's supposed to be there there's a like a plastic flat nothing there just that plastic flat so i will leave that in situ um, it's only a bit of masking tape by the looks of it that holds it on. It's a bit of staining underneath there, but if you look, that actually will rub away. And I would imagine that's probably from um, cleaning at some stage, so mucky mucky me. <laughs> anyway, let's just give that a quick brush out. So, you know, all these fixed um, carpets, I would imagine you could do it to all of them. Um, you know, please don't blame me if you go and do it and you can't get it all back in. This is just my way of doing it. Um, I am a bit of a clean freak. Being a lorry driver, the worst people in the world because uh, my truck has to be spotlessly clean inside. And uh, Sarah will, Sarah will uh, uh, tell you that as well because uh, she has been out in the truck with me. But anyway, now that's all lovely and clean on the back. Now let's just do that as a groove on the on the inside okay so that has got this little groove all the way around the inside where the carpet goes so we'll put that back down making sure that we're over the top of the screw holes because I don't want to go making more screw holes we'll put these screws back in noting that we are actually on the lowest setting so that it doesn't over tighten okay so that's the carpet as you can see there is only one way it goes around the rounded edges there and nice uh, fixed fixed uh, corners there 90 degree corners there so the way I do it is to actually push that first corner in let me just get that screwdriver because uh, you need something just to push it underneath and then once you've pushed that corner in just keep pushing all the way along until that goes in and that's that then push it over to one side you've got this little tie out here which you can actually use to get your finger in so you can pull the whole lot out. So this is actually meant to come out of this actual um, uh, frame, if you like. So that's that all pushed up in that corner. 
just lift the corner up, get that corner in, and then we can push that all in. Okay, I'm trying to do this as quickly as possible. I don't want to take up too much of your time today. Um, yeah, there we go. Some places are a little bit fiddly. Um, when I did this last time, I actually caught my finger. Uh, the air was blue, <laughs> quite blue for a little while. Um, I did puncture the skin, so I try and keep my fingers out of the way as much as possible now. Okay, so that's right into the corner. What we'll do is just run that along there, run that all the way down there, get all the imperfections out of the lumps. Right, okay, so this edge, and um, I don't know if it's because I've washed it, but it's a bit more a bit more malleable if that's the right word to use we push that all under there push that underneath there i am rushing this somewhat because i it's um i don't want to make a, a long video out of something so simple okay so that's right underneath there let's just push that right in there As you can see that's all nicely fixed it back down all the way around the corners it's all the way in uh, like I say you've got these gray bars or you know where the where the dye or where it's been um, dyed by the Sun uh, I'm not gonna worry too much about that you can actually buy uh, fabric spray paint um, and I don't know if it's worth doing it I probably won't do it um, but anyway yes that's um, that's that done. Anyway, very short video today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it the thumbs up if you did. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.